Hello everyone, welcome to the seventh episode of Under the Skin. This series is all about taking a closer look at the meaning behind the names of the legendary skins in Battlefield 1. I'm your host Christopher, the video game historian, and as always, I'm going to take one gun from each class to inspect. On this episode, I'm going to take a look at the skins for the Hell Regal 1915, the M1907 SL, the MG15 NA, and finally, the M1903. First up is the Hell Regal, and regardless of your thoughts on the weapon, I still have to go over the Archduke skin for it. This one is a bit obvious as a reference to Archduke Franz Ferdinand, whose assassination kicked off the First World War. Born in Graz, Austria in 1863, he would be third in line to the Austro-Hungarian Empire. With the passing of his own father and the Emperor's son, Ferdinand would soon be the heir to the throne by 1896. In 1900, he married Sofia Shotek von Shotkova and had three kids together whose succession was denounced as a term of agreement with Emperor Franz Josef for the wedding to take place. Ferdinand was not a very popular fellow, especially with the ruling elite, as he wanted to do away with the dual monarchy and replace it with a trialism which would have given the Slavs an equal voice in the government. He also considered a federalism created by 16 individual states. In 1908, many Western governments were upset when the empire annexed Bosnia and Herzegovina, along with the proponents of a greater Serbia who wanted them to lead a pan-Slavic state. On June 28, 1914, as Ferdinand visited Bosnia, he and his wife will be assassinated by Gavriel Princip, a member of the Black Hand. What ensured after was every major European power declaring war on one another. Next up is the Blue Devil skin for the M1907 SL. While it is the mascot of a major US college, that is not what this skin refers to. Instead, it refers to the French Alpine soldiers, the Chasseurs Alpine. Created in 1888, members were recruited from the mountainous regions of France near the Swiss border. By World War I, they would be distinguished by their berets, blue uniforms, and their unwillingness to quit. It was these characteristics that impressed the Germans so much during the 1915 Vage campaign that they nicknamed them the Blau Teufel, or the Blue Devils. Their motto would soon become, never to be taken alive, as they were unrelenting in their attacks against the heavily defended mountaintop the Germans were holding. They managed to capture that point three times before finally being repelled back due to heavy casualties from heavy German artillery. When the U.S. entered the war, it was the surviving soldiers of the Blue Devils that trained the American Expeditionary Forces in June 1917. They would also visit the United States in 1918 to help promote liberty bonds to finance the war, along with giving speeches across the U.S. The Koenig, yet another name that could refer to King Wilhelm II, just like with the Kaiser skin. However, since I already talked about Wilhelm with the Prussian skin for the MG14 in my last video, I'm going to take a jump here and say that the skin for the MG15 could also refer to the Koenig class battleship, the SMS Koenig. This battleship was built at the Kaiserlich Werft in Wilhelmshaven and launched on March 1st, 1913. It was also the first capital ship for Germany to have all of its guns on the center line, so they could easily be brought to either side. The SMS Koenig also had three sister ships, the Kronprinz Wilhelm, Mark Graft, and Grosser Kürfürst. It was manned with 41 officers and nearly 1,100 crewmen. Its main battery was 305mm 50 caliber guns on five dual turrets, along with 14 single casement mounts of 150mm 45 caliber guns. The Koenig and its sister ships played a role during the Battle of Jutland and Operation Albion against the Russians. Just like was the SMS Kaiserin, the Koenig and its sisters were surrendered to the Allies after armistice and scudded at Scapa Flow in June of 1919. Hopefully with the upcoming Turning Tides DLC, we begin to see the Kaiser, Kaiserin, and Koenig class battleships 
as playable vehicles. Finally, the Devil Dog skin for the M1903. Just like the Doughboy skin, Devil Dogs has become a term of endearment for the US Marine Corps. It is often seen in recruitment ads and Marines to this day are still referred to as Devil Dogs. It is said that during the war, the Germans who were swept out of Belau Wood by the Marines called them Teufelhunden in their reports, meaning Devil Dogs. Or so it's said. In recruitment ads afterwards, the term Teufelhunden appears, yet any proper speaking German could note that that is wrong. While Teufel does mean devil and Hunden is the plural word for dogs, the proper word is actually Teufelshunde, leading some to suspect that the word is of American origin. In his 1921 book, The American Language, H.L. Mencken states that the Germans didn't have opprobrious nicknames for their enemies, yet there is evidence that terms like the Blue Devils and the Harlem Hellfighters were given to these soldiers by the Germans. Who knows? It's possible that the term was of German origin and that an American just misheard or misprinted it when creating the recruitment poster. I don't argue with Marines, so for me, it's of German origin. That's all for this episode. Hopefully you all enjoyed it and if you had, please like the video, subscribe to my channel, and leave your comments down below. Also don't forget to follow me on social media with Twitter and Facebook. You can join me in the Forum Felix Platoon along with the best of the worst players on all platforms for some very entertaining games. You can also check them out on Twitter at at Forum Remember, you're not worse, just late. See you on the battlefield.